Hello. Oh. Mr. Holmes. Sherlock, please. Oh, this is a prime spot. Must be expensive. Uh, Mrs. Hudson, the landlady, has given me a special deal. Owes me a favour. A few years back, her husband got himself sentenced to death in Florida. I was able to help out. Sorry, you stopped her husband being executed? Oh, no, I ensured it. Sherlock. <laughs> Mrs. Hudson, Dr. John Watson. Hello. I do. Come in. Thank you. Shall we? Well, this could be very nice. Very nice indeed. Yes. Yes, I think so. My thoughts precisely. So I went straight ahead and moved in. Cleaned out. Oh. So this is well. All obviously, I can um, <clears throat> straighten things up a bit. To skull. Friend of mine. When I say friend. What do you think then, Doctor Watson? There's another bedroom upstairs if you'll be needing two bedrooms. Of course we'll be needing two. Oh, don't worry. There's all sorts around here. Mrs. Turner next door's got married ones. Oh, Sherlock, the mess you've made. I looked you up on the internet last night. Anything interesting? Found your website, The Science of Deduction. What did you think? You said you could identify a software designer by his tie and an airline pilot by his left thumb? Yes. And I can read your military career and your face and your leg and your brother's drinking habits and your mobile phone. How? What about these suicides then, Sherlock? Thought that'd be right up your street. Three exactly the same. Four. There's been a fourth. There's something different this time. A fourth? 